All right, we got the DPF off of a 6.7 power stroke. Um, truck would not regen. DPF was completely clogged with a soot level of 151%. So a new DPF for this truck is about five, six grand. We got a place that we could uh, send it out and they'll bake it. Basically cleans out the uh, whole DPF and normally they're able to salvage it, which they were. The only problem is they have to cut it in half. Uh, it looks like they did use a torch, so it's pretty rough. So I'm gonna have to weld this back together now and install it into the truck. So I'm gonna clean up these edges, get it lined up, get some tacks on it, and start welding. All right, got it lined up about as good as it's gonna get since they used the torch. Hit it with the flap wheel, try to get as flat as possible. We got a little bit of a gap, maybe a sixteenth of an inch. Other spots are close, like on the bottom, but I can work with that. I'm gonna grab the MIG welder and we'll just throw some beads on it. Got the old ESAB MIG Master 250, 250. Get her done, bud. It ain't my best work, but she'll hold. Absolutely horrible. But I had to work with the gap that we had. And it just needs to seal up. So this is what you get. This is fleet maintenance. This isn't performance fabrication.